Nestled in the heart of Speyside is the Craigellachie Bridge, built by civil engineer Thomas Telford over 200 years ago. It's played a vital role in Murray's story ever since, famously hosting the Highlanders Amalgamation Parade in 1994, and even making it onto a Royal Mail stamp. But nobody knows who actually owns it. Well, it was one of the first of its kind in the world. For us, to, to pro progress our uh, aim of getting the bridge restored and highlighting the importance of the bridge and everyone concerned with it, we can't approach any bodies or get anyone involved until in actual ownership is uh, made clear. Murray Council were thought to be the owners and they do carry out general maintenance, but they say they don't have any records to show they own the bridge. It's quite bizarre, we don't know who owns one of the country's most famous bridges. Now the Murray Council we thought owned it told me they don't own it and they don't know who does own it but the registers of Scotland have told me that they do believe the council does own it. So we have to solve this mystery so the community can work to protect the future of the bridge and make sure it's celebrated as it should be as a, a major iconic bridge. In 2014, a study found the bridge needed repair work costing upwards of £400,000, a bill unlikely to entice an owner to come forward. The community groups say they will keep working to solve this mystery of ownership. But for now, one of Scotland's most historic and beautiful bridges remains unclaimed. Emma Murray, STV News, Craig Ellicke.